Happy Monday, everyone. A little bit of snow as we head through the weekend. Not too bad. Uh, just under an inch for the Medford area, so not a lot, and it was gone mostly by about noon as we got into Sunday morning into the Sunday afternoon. And then clear skies prevailed, especially late last night into early this morning. So cold temperatures to start the day and with some leftover moisture from that system, which is now well off to the south of us with the potential for some freezing fog early this morning. High pressure building in, but it's more the lack of low pressure in the area that's bringing us the clearer conditions. Once we get rid of some clouds, get rid of some fog this morning into the afternoon, maybe just after lunchtime or so. That's when we could start to see more sunshine out there. We'll keep that going later tonight into tomorrow. It's so looking like early tomorrow morning could see some very cold temperatures, especially east of the Cascades. And then once again, high pressure moves in just a little bit more. But behind that, as you can see, further off to the left, further off to the west, more low pressure systems, more stormy conditions. That'll arrive about Wednesday and Thursday, as early as Tuesday night. So as we zoom in a little closer, you can see plenty of cloud cover, plenty of of fog, especially in areas like the Rogue Valley, a little further to the north, Douglas County, Josephine County, but a lot of that should eventually clear out as we head later into the day. We do have weather alerts. It's going to be very cold this morning, going to be cold again later tonight into tomorrow, so we'll hold that mainly for the coast and areas that haven't quite seen the very freezing temperatures. Curry County, Coos County, a little bit of Douglas and Del Norte County involved in that as well. Otherwise, here's your pinpoint forecast. While we do have some lingering moisture out there, some lingering showers from time to time, most of it's out off the coast or east of the Cascades. So as we get into the afternoon, maybe some areas a little higher in elevation could see some precipitation squeezed out from time to time, but it is looking like a dry day overall. We'll continue into Tuesday, and as you can see, mostly dry conditions. And a little bit later Tuesday, this is noon, Tuesday into Wednesday, that's when we start to see that next system start to push in. This is Wednesday morning, possibly a little bit of a mix of rain and snow for the Medford area as we go into Wednesday morning. That system slightly warmer than the one we saw Sunday morning, so we're right on that line. Do we see snow or do we see any rain out there? Now, not much of a chance at all for any snow for the coast, so we'll say frost early. Cloudy, then clearing as you head into the afternoon. Does warm up into the upper 40s. And the West Valley's frost and fog early with mostly sunny skies by the afternoon once we get rid of the fog. Could take a little while to do that, though. And because of that, we don't warm up a whole lot. We'll get into maybe the low to mid 40s in the West Valleys. And then east of the Cascades, partly cloudy, then eventually clearing. Not warming up much either, but you're also starting fairly cold with 32 degrees for Klamath Falls overnight dropping into the single digits. Another very cold night. We'll keep that going into Tuesday and for the most part dry, but then we head into Wednesday and Thursday. That next system I mentioned comes on through, warms us up slightly with a warmer front, and that's mainly towards rain as we go towards Thursday. Wednesday morning, though, some potential for snow showers, so we'll keep that on there. And then another chance of showers after a brief break on Friday. The Klamath Basin, the trend is a little bit drier next couple of days and then a little bit wetter and uh, cold overnight, but not as cold as we have been. Chance of snow Wednesday and Thursday with Friday drying out before another chance of snow showers this weekend. Checking out Northern California, chance of snow Wednesday into Thursday, dry Friday before Saturday and Sunday, another chance of snow. So a few on again, off again ch shower chances and could see showers as early as Tuesday night out on the coast. That will continue into rain likely on Wednesday with showers likely on Thursday and another round of showers likely towards the weekend.